got dropped off on this island and my friends and I will be spending the next six hours making giant sand art. Today, I'm challenging my friends to an insane sand art building challenge and whoever makes the best sand art wins $10,000. But throughout the competition, we will be competing in a ton of challenges to win huge advantages. Yay! Woo! As well as terrible punishments. Oh, Your piece is getting ruined! So who's going to make the best giant sand art and who's getting punished? We'll have to find out. Are you guys all ready to make sand art? Yes! Yeah! Yeah! All right, your six hours starts now. Oh my gosh, wait, from here? What? <laughs> Best giant sand art wins it all. I got you, I got you. This is absolutely crazy. I don't know why everyone just jumped off. They could have just waited like me. Yes, completed the trek to the island. But we're ready for the challenge, whatever it is. I'm excited to kick everyone's butt and make a really good sand art piece. I'm so excited, we're at the beach. I'm here to get my W this time. I'm gonna win. Just look at us, smiles all around and having a good time. But little do we know, by the end of this video, that's not gonna be the case. Wow. This video is absolutely brutal, from terrible punishments Please. to what mother nature has in store for us. Cover your pieces, cover your pieces. And in this video, I'm going to create some sand art as well. I see all of your comments saying I should compete, so I'm just gonna compete for fun today. Technically, I can't win, but these guys are all going down because I'm gonna make the best sand art. And in this video, we're not only competing with each other, but we're also competing with Mother Nature because a huge storm is brewing. As long as the wind doesn't change, the storm's not gonna get here, but actually, I think the wind just changed. It's perfectly fine for now, unless the wind changes. Our boat driver said if the wind changes, we're screwed. And there they go. All right, I guess we're stuck here for the day. All right, guys. So in today's video, we're doing things a little differently. In this video, the winner will get a tenth of a penny per view. Wow. So if this video gets 1 million views, I'll give the winner $1,000. If it gets 10 million views, I'll give them $10,000. Really? And if this video manages to get 100 million views, I will literally give the winner $100,000. But that's not all. For today, we're also going to be doing a second place prize and a third place prize. Wait, really? What? If you get second place, I'll give you $1,000. What? If you get third place, I'll give you $500. Yay! And on top of that, each of you will be able to bet on one person. If they win, I'll give you $500. What? All right, Jake. Who are you placing your bet on? David. Oh, okay. Michelle, who do you think is gonna win? I think Mackenzie's gonna win today. Oh, Woo! okay. David. I'm also gonna bet on Mackenzie. Yay! Ben, bet on someone. Michelle. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you wanna bet on David? All right, Faith, if David wins, you get 500. Mackenzie, bet on someone else. What the? Uh, All right, I'll bet on me. Wait, did you guys hear that thunder? To kick things off, my friends will be competing in their first mini challenge. Guys, trust me, there's gonna be a lot more challenges and a lot more punishments. So for the first challenge, you will be metal detecting. First three people to bring me a piece of buried metal are safe, everyone else gets punished. No! no. Oh my gosh, I don't wanna be punished. Has everyone else used a metal detector before? Plug it in, plug it in. Oh, the band already started. On. Guys, we're our first three people to bring me a piece of buried metal. It says there's something here, so I'm gonna try it. All right, guys, this is my sister Faith. Are you excited that I brought you here? Am I the best big brother ever? Yes, you Just gotta find me any piece of buried metal. Oh, wow, that storm is really coming in. I noticed that there's a level of like how deep it is. I just heard a dig and now I'm just digging and hoping for the best. What is this? What is that? And to Ben's surprise, he seemed to have found the first piece of metal. Is this a bottle cap? Oh! Did you get something? I got a bottle cap. Wait, actually? Yeah. Let me see. All right, that works, Ben! Let's go! Hey! Ben, this is indeed a very rusty metal bottle cap. Guys, Ow. Ben just found a metal bottle cap. What? So far, one person is safe. I was not expecting to win the first challenge, and can't wait to see what Zach has in store for me. While Ben was able to find a piece of metal pretty quickly, my other friends weren't having quite the same luck. So hard. Jake, don't give up. The punishment is brutal. Dude. Come on, Michelle, you got it. You got it. Why? Why? And since Ben is now safe, he began to help my little sister and decided to use it to his advantage. Faith, you better remember this. Don't target me later. <laughs> I will, Ben, I promise. 
it. Wait, you will target me? No, I will remember. Okay, good. With only two spots left, competition started to heat up between Jake and Michelle. What's happening? After 15 minutes of looking for metal in the sand, it proved to be a little too difficult. So I came up with another way to determine the winners of this challenge. All right, since Ben was the only one that found metal, he's gonna get an advantage. The other two people that are gonna be safe have to find me a full seashell. A full seashell? Well, a full half. Oh my gosh. It can't be shattered. Finding seashells is so hard here. Where do I find seashells? Is this is half. Let me see. Yep, that works. Woo! Zach! I see it. Yep, that works. Woo! All right. Michelle and Mackenzie, you're safe. Thank goodness I found a seashell because there was no way I was gonna metal detect anything. All right, losers, come over here. Now that three contestants are safe, it's time to distribute the punishments to the remaining artists. David, Faith, Jake, would you like to hear what your punishment is? Did you no. mean advantage? No. Punishment. Wow. For the first 30 minutes, you guys can only sculpt using your feet. What? All right, have fun with it. That sucks. And that's just one disadvantage the artist will have to find a way to work around. There's a ton of mini challenges to come and opportunities for the contestants to completely sabotage one another. Keep watching to see which one perseveres and comes out on top. And now for Ben's advantage. And I had something super simple in mind. Ben, I'll let you place a bet on one more person for 500. I'll bet on Jake. Woo! All right, so if Jake wins, I'll give you an additional $500. Sweet. All right, guys, let's start building your pieces. We don't have all day. Okay, I'm gonna start building my piece with my feet. This is stupid. I'm gonna do a unicorn. How does one even sculpt with their feet? What does that even mean? Well, I guess I'm gonna start by well, making a mountain or something. Seriously, I'm making a moon. Don't tell anyone. And so, as the losers attempted to work with their feet, Ben, Michelle, and Mackenzie got straight to work, unaffected by any punishment. I'm gonna go pretty big today. I know what I wanna make. This way, not doing a dragon, maybe. I don't even know what I'm building right now. And like I said, I'm also making a sand art piece, so I got straight to work as well. I'm gonna start out by piling a ton of sand so it's elevated. Jake, what are you making? A mountain. But I'm making a mountain. You have to use your hands. You can come up with something a little bit more creative, you know? I'll do a dragon. No! Are you guys always doing the same things? I always do something different. Sometimes I do a blue dragon, sometimes it's a spiky dragon, sometimes I do a fire dragon, sometimes I do an earth dragon. I am so excited to be here today. I feel like one lucky duck. I don't usually go to places like this and Zach is inviting me to be part of the crew for a little bit. So I'm super excited. Next time I'm gonna force you to go to Hawaii. That sounds so awful. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think that sounds awful too. Jake, you're my good friend. I'm not gonna force you to go to Hawaii. It's okay. I would be so pissed if I went to Hawaii. I'm gonna create a masterpiece today. And I think I'm off to a good start. I'd hate to go to Hawaii. Don't worry, Jake, I got you. You're not going. Ben! Yeah? Come here! As Jake continued to work with his feet, it seemed like he got a bit bored because apparently, he would rather cause havoc than build a sand mound, even with so much on the line. Hey. Hey. Am I helping you kick this? Can you help me kick something else? Yeah, what do you want to kick? exact piece. Just walk up. You just kick me in the leg, and I'll be like, oh! oh I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Yeah. Ben, ha ha ha! Ben, ha, ha. So I hate you, I hate you! Oh! Hey! Dude, Jake tricked me! <laughs> Bro, Jake, what the heck, man? Hey, Zach. Uh, Where's your piece, man? Right here, right here, right here, right here. I'm sorry, I did not mean to. Hey, that's my piece. All right, man. Let's go. Let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Okay. Well, there goes my piece, too. I did not trip him. I did not. Oh, I did not trip him. Oh, I did not. Oh. oh, hi, Mark. Now, while I was stressed and had to restart my piece, Michelle didn't seem to have a care in the world. Even with the threat of a huge storm ruining everything. I guess I have to start from scratch. All right, here we go. It's a good day. We're at the Bahamas. I'm thinking of doing a snail. 
I think you'll look very cute with a big shell. Oh wow, that bird is really close. As all of my friends started the process of creating a sand art piece, some instead ended up in the ocean. It's extremely hard to make sand art with your feet. So I thought I'd just come take a dip. Here's what I have so far, but I'm honestly not able to really do much. So I'm just gathering some water and I'm gonna go take a little dip so I cool off. Oh my God. Jake, let's walk together because I don't want to work on my, with my feet. I can't do much anymore. No. And while in the water, David came up with an idea. Wait, so we have an alliance? Are you gonna deceive me? Because the whole thing is that you are the deceiver. That's what I'm I not gonna deceive you. Gonna That's exactly what a deceiver no, would say. That. I, no, but I think Ben is gonna be a threat. So I think don't. Don't team with Ben. Don't team up with him. Yeah. So then alliance? this alliance is actually true because there is a first, second, and third. Yeah. So let's do an alliance. And fortunately for David, Jake agreed. Okay, we could be an alliance. Exactly. Faith is here. Hey, Queen. Wanna play mermaids? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's pretty. Get bigger. They're definitely more vigorous. And just then, David, my videographer, walked up on the contestants. We can be one of the like more evil mermaids that kind of like, you know what I mean? Yeah, we can be evil sorceress mermaids. What's going on <laughs> over here? We're playing mermaids. No, we're not. I mean, <laughs> yes we are. That's Wait. all we were talking about out here, actually. We weren't talking about anything else. So we have an alliance? Okay, okay we, we, we can be an alliance. alliance. You guys can tell me what's going on. Well, we just happen to be the three people that have to use their feet in the shower. Oh, that's right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I'd rather take a little dip than kick the fan. <laughs> and now it's time for the next mini challenge. This one's gonna be fun. Everyone, gather in. It's time for a mini challenge. For this challenge, I need you to get in teams of three. Oh. All right, so it's you three against you three, correct? Yeah. I need each team to select a team captain. The team captain's automatically gonna be safe. I'm not feeling dominant today. <laughs> no, me neither. Guys, I can so be the team God. captain. All right, I'm We're the team so captain. compatible. We're Guys, keep in mind the team captain cannot be punished, and the punishments are brutal. I don't think I have to worry about being punished because I think we're going to win. Jupiter? All right, guys, who's team captain over here? Mackenzie! Mackenzie? Yep. All right, guys, who's team captain, captain here? Me. Jake. Jake. Jake's safe? Yeah. yeah. Something's All right. swimming over there. <laughs> But before we could start the challenge, Mackenzie spotted something in the water. Uh, guys, there's something swimming over. Oh, what is it? Wait. It might be a stinger. It's a stinger! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, oh, Alright, guys. We're gonna have each team gather up over here. We're doing a relay race! Each person has to come, high-five me, and go back. First team to finish gets an advantage. The losing team gets a punishment. You can swim or run. All right, are you ready? Yeah, set, go! It looked like Jake was off to a super fast start. Run, run, run! Oh, you go, you go, come on! Go, go! Oh wait, my sister used to swim competitively. No, don't say that. No. <laughs> and then she quit. With just one more artist left to swim, the race seemed like a complete blowout. Come on, go, 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 Michelle, go, go, go. But everything was about to change when Jake's team started to slow down. Go back, go, go. Come on, come on, come on, man, come on, come on. Come on, man, come on! Go! Go! Go, Ben! That was so close! Oh my god. Alright, Team David, Jake, Faith, you guys are the winners! Each of you guys get one immunity pass at the start of any mini challenge. Nice. If you guys don't use it at the start of the challenge, then you can't use it anymore. Okay. All right, Mackenzie, you're safe. Unfortunately for the losers, the punishment is not gonna be fun. Michelle, Ben, you guys need to dig a hole and bury yourselves alive to the neck for 30 minutes. 30 minutes? I was able to win an immunity pass, and I also don't use my feet anymore, so I can get started on my piece and hopefully have something look good now. Also, I really hope that Jake stays true to his alliance because I could really use his help with the mini challenges. And if I get second, he gets first, I still get some money, so I think it's a good deal. Now that each contestant has a bit of their art pieces started, I wanted to know what they were making. All right, David, what are you working on here? Look at my horse head. Oh, wait, that actually looks pretty good. Yeah, it's gonna be lying in the sand. A little pretty horse. Okay, it might look a little dead, but we'll see. <laughs> no. Wait, Jake really wants to kick it, it seems. No, I'm just kidding, David. I won't target you. 
Good. Michelle, how are you doing? I'm doing well. I am doing a snail. Like from SpongeBob, like Gary? Similar to Gary, but a little bit more realistic. Okay. I do have to be buried for like 30 minutes first. Yeah, I guess you do have to go get buried right after this. Yeah. Jake, what's the plan here? I'm making a move. Actually? Yep. Nice hat, Jake. I literally can't see your face. Hello? Thank you. All right, what's the plan, Mackenzie? Right now, I am trying to make an octopus. Oh, wait, that's actually a really good idea. Yeah. And speaking of octopi, I have a friend to introduce you later in this video that we're launching oh. on ZHCstore.com. Okay, don't tell anyone, because uh, you guys aren't supposed to see till later, but it's our new octopus plushie. Can I get one since I'm making an octopus? If you win. And as you guys know, our special guest in this video is actually one of my little sisters. So be nice to her in the comments. I will read them. Wait, guys, be nice to my little sister. This is my little sister, but not my youngest sister. She's my second youngest sister. Faith, you're definitely one of the top two sisters I've ever had. Wow, Zachary. <laughs> Wait. I like, now I sound like David. Wow, Zachary. Uh. <laughs> And she didn't seem very confident, so I had to remind her that she really does have a chance to win. I'm starting with a starfish. This is lazy. I'm gonna See? show mom and dad, and they're gonna yell at you. I've been working hard. I think me being here to shoot with you guys is I'm just here for the fun. You don't think you're actually gonna win? Look at everyone else's already. You guys are like so professional. Be, be confident in yourself and I say am you're gonna win. But you guys are like professionally doing this. Ben, I don't like that you're doing a dragon. What do you mean? I think your dragon looks good. Ben, I think your dragon looks good. Thank you, and I hate your dragon. I hate your dragon too. Are we done here? Yeah. And just then, I had an idea. Hey everyone, and just to spice things up a little bit, David, I'm gonna let you bet on someone. Yeah! If they win, you get $500. Oh yeah. David, go take a look around and place a bet on one person other than me because I'm not competing in the main challenge. Okay. All of you guys that regularly watch the Crafts Channel know that David is 100% cursed. Every time he bets on someone, he loses. He's currently 0 of 13. It's just been a misfortunate chain of events that I don't really have any control over. And You're I'm just not, cursed. I'm not cursed. All right, David, who are you betting on? Well, after looking at everyone's piece, I think I'm gonna bet on Ken's. Mackenzie, you might have just lost. I know. And although she was now cursed, Mackenzie remained positive. I'm gonna try so hard to break the curse for you. Mackenzie, you can do this. I'm not cursed, but the more you think about it, the more cursed I'm gonna become, so don't no, think about it. You're not cursed. You know what? You're gonna be a good luck charm today. Woo! I'm, I'm changing the No, I'm attacking course. Mackenzie. No. Just because David bet on you, now I kind of feel like attacking your piece. I think I might have an overall curse where the thunderstorm hits pretty soon here and everyone's piece is ruined and no one wins anything. Why are you manifesting that for us? And after losing a bunch of challenges in a row, Mackenzie was really feeling the pressure. I want to win really, really bad because I'm tired of showing up to these crafts challenges and coming all the way from Florida and then walking home empty handed. So today needs to be different. Mackenzie, you fly back. You don't walk back. Oh, did I say walk? And finally, Ben and Michelle started their punishment. It's like we're digging our graves. It's like the horror yeah. movies where they're like, dig a hole. Very and nice. guys, I'm digging a hole as well. Nice, I'm Jake. proud of you, Jake. Hi, right, my turn. As Ben and Michelle buried themselves, the other contestants continue to work and plan. I'm looking around and I'm not feeling great, but there is always hope, right? I don't think I'm going to make a moon anymore. I think I'm going to make a fish. The shape is coming along like how I want it to, so I'm pretty happy so far. That sure looks cozy. I'm internally freaking out. I'm still working on my starfish. I think I've made some good progress on putting some dimension, but I don't know. I'm looking at everyone else's stuff, and they're so cool. I don't know how they do it. My hat fell off. I need help getting it. Please. Honestly, this isn't too bad. This is kind of relaxing. No, it's not bad. Okay. Okay, so far it's going pretty good, and my horse slash unicorn is looking pretty cute. And finally, Ben and Michelle fulfilled their punishment. All right, Ben, and Michelle, your time's up. You can get back to work. Woo! Yay! First, the dogs come out. Ugh. Ugh. Now that their punishment has ended, we can finally start the third mini challenge. 
All right, everyone, gather up over here. Jake, David, Faith, do any of you want to use your immunity card for this challenge? I'll save mine. No. I'll save mine. All right, so for this challenge, you guys have three minutes to do a giant drawing in the sand. Whoever has the best piece wins. First and second place will win something. Go! Oh, gosh. If it's too small, I'm not going to like it. All right, what are you drawing, Michelle? I'm drawing Bun Bun. OK. Of course, <laughs> Ben's drawing a dragon. All right. Hey, no, 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 no. OK, Zach. Bruh, I'm literally ruining my piece because I'm stepping in it. All right, Faith, what are you oh drawing? Oh, my god. Are you guys all draw? I are you drawing a box? I don't know. What should I draw? Well, at least finish the box. Oh, OK, David. That's looking pretty good. All right, two minutes left. Wait, Jake, did you restart? Yes, because I'm stepping all over it. It's too big. Oh, my one eye is so much higher than the other. Everyone, one minute. Ben's piece is like this close to getting swept away by the waves. Watch out. Stop. All right, 30 seconds. David, you're going into my sister's piece. I went away from that. All right, five, four, three, two, one. All right, time's up. All right, let's take a look at everyone's pieces. All right, Jake, not bad. That's pretty cute. All right, Mackenzie. I that. Okay, okay, yeah, I see it. That's pretty good. Not bad, not bad. Okay, Michelle, yeah. let's see yours. Any cute little bun bun. Yours is a little small, Michelle. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. Michelle, I did say big. Okay, not bad, Ben. Not bad. All right, let's. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Dino Heart Zach? Why does that look like a chair? No, it doesn't. <laughs> Yeah, it does. Like oh, David. whoa. And then David. Unicorn with a mane. Oh my goodness. Wait. I think I know who's first. All right, David, you're first. Wow. Okay, good. That's insane. I wish Jake went a little deeper with his. Okay, I think this is a close one between Mackenzie and Ben's. After some further deliberation, I came up with a decision. Okay, right, no, I think I like Ben's better. Woo! All right, David, Ben, come over here. There's two advantages. Okay. David, you get first pick, Ben will get the other one. Okay, first advantage is in one hour, you can take two buckets of water and pour it on anyone's piece. Okay. So you can target two people if you want, or the same person. And the second one is you get someone's help for 30 minutes. Me, but I do have advantages and alliances already in play. Why are none of them with me? I don't know, Bean. I'll do the water bucket because it's more power and more leverage. All right, so. In one hour, you get to choose two people or the same person and dump an entire bucket of water. Okay. Not me. I don't know, Bean. Are you kidding me? Wait. Whatever, but I don't want to be whatever, deceitful. Whatever, I don't want to be whatever, deceitful. Whatever. All right, Ben. Who are you grabbing for help? All right. Can I grab your help? <gasps> if you want. Yeah, I kind of want Zach's help. Actually? Yeah. I want Zach's help. Well, you, well, you got first pick. You didn't pick that. I didn't know you were an option. You didn't ask questions, David. Right. So now I'm going to help Ben for 30 minutes, and I'm going to make sure he wins. Yeah, we're definitely getting a water bucket now. <laughs> a water bucket. All right, Ben, you have a good base here. Yeah. Which part do you want me to help you with? If you want to start, like, doing cool details on the head. And so I started helping Ben with his piece. I'm going to be helping Ben for 30 minutes. I'm not too worried because technically I'm not in the challenge, but I'm going to try my best to make Ben's piece really good. What the heck, Zach? That's freaking sick. Yeah. I'm super relieved that I won that last mini challenge. Okay. However, I'm really annoyed that Zach is currently helping Bean. I kind of regret not choosing Zach's help because honestly, making his piece look really, really good. So if anything, now Bean is just the target. Apparently, Ben won Zachary's help, which puts the rest of us at a disadvantage because Zach clearly knows what he's doing. But if Bean wins, at least I get $500. Since Mackenzie knew David also won an advantage, she decided to try and get some information out of him. David. What? What did you win? Water buckets. <gasps> on people's pieces. On how many people's pieces? I get two buckets. And I put on whoever I want. Can you please not put it on me? All right, so I've helped Ben for around 15 minutes, and honestly, I think it's looking pretty good. I think I might like it even more than mine now. Dude, it looks so sick. Ben, I'm gonna make sure you get this dub. Thanks, Zach. I have a feeling that everyone has seen that Zach is helping me. I feel like I'm gonna be a target in the future. I really wish I won that challenge because I really wanted Zach's help. I feel like such a big advantage. Ben's piece is looking very good right now. Although I really want to win today, I heard Zach said that there's a second and third place prize, so... I feel like I have a good chance of winning some money. I know, I don't really have much done with my piece yet, okay? But guess what? There's still a second and third place prize. So even if maybe I partially finish, it might be good enough to even get $1,000 or 500 which I'll take, you know? 
Still going for that first place prize though. Just then, my videographer, David Two, started to mess with Jake. It'd be a shame if someone came over and stepped on the side of your little hill. Excuse me. Ow, ow. Oh, excuse me. Dude. Get off my lawn. <laughs> All right, Ben. My 30 minutes is done. Thanks, Zach. All right. Oh, that's a lot of sand. Zach went crazy. That actually looks so cool. After finishing the face of Ben's dragon, I decided to check in with the other contestants. All right, let's go check out the other pieces. Wait, Faith, this is actually kind of coming together. Hey, that's actually not half bad. Really? Yeah, it looks pretty solid. Okay. All right, let's check out Jake's piece. Are you still making the moon? Yeah. Shh. Just kidding. It's not the moon. What is it? I don't know. Would you actually not know? No, I secretly know. Oh. Dude! Wait, Jake, what is it? It's gonna be a cool fish. Wait, that's gonna look really cool. <sighs> Alright, make sure you finish, Jake. I'm gonna try. Alright, cat's out of the bag now. Alright, Michelle, how's your snail going? I think it's okay. I don't know. Which part's the snail? Here, here. I kind of see it. Yeah, I haven't had much time to work on it. Alright, Mackenzie, how's it going here? Oh, I like the shape so far. Yeah. It's looking pretty solid. Mackenzie, I would take a look around at a couple pieces. Yeah. A couple pieces are looking pretty yeah, solid Yeah, I know. Too. I've been hearing crap about beans. Ben's is looking pretty good. Jake doesn't have a lot down, but his might be kind of good. Really? And I'm not going to lie, my, my sister's isn't too bad either. Don't have to lie. Ready? It's looking pretty solid. Yeah. I think if you can get the tentacles really nice, that's going to look really good. I'm going to try. David! Look at my pony. All right, Mackenzie, actually, I think you have some competition here. David, that is really good. Yeah, okay. I'll keep figuring this out. And just as I started to think the artist's pieces were starting to take shape and looking great, the storm finally hit. Guys! Why is it raining? I think it's raining. No! I think the wind did change and it's starting to rain. All right, come on, guys. It's starting to rain. Put the cameras under the tent. It's happening. It's raining. I don't know, but I really hope I just didn't dig that for three hours for nothing. Wait, guys, you should protect your pieces like Mackenzie. Apparently, mine's not good enough. So protect it, Michelle. Protect it. As the rain continued to pour, the artists rushed to cover their art pieces as we scrambled to protect the cameras as well. I feel hopeless because I don't want my towel to even touch my starfish. <laughs> it's literally already carved out of the floor. Charlie, I don't think I'm going to damage it. Yeah, Charlie. guys, cover your pieces. Cover your pieces. I hope the rain ruins everything. Everyone's piece Wait, because I don't need to cover really mine. Raining. My piece is too big. Oh, ben, <laughs> Ben, I worked so hard on that. Oh uh, god. Oh shoot. It's like just gonna ruin. Charlie. Oh, 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 the rain's gonna ruin it. I know, but I can't. Fine, cover this side. Cover this side. Wait, look at how Michelle's working right now. What am I gonna? There's no. Everyone take the towel. Oh my god. Wait, the this rain is literally is gonna it. be. The rain is ruining Zach's piece. Holy crap! <laughs> Zach's piece is getting ruined by the rain. Zach, hurry! Your piece is getting ruined! The rain is so strong in this one area! Yo! The rain is so strong! Oh! As time went on, the rain began to pour even harder. What? Okay, okay, I got it, I got it. Oh. Okay. David, this is gonna break. We literally have tens of thousands of dollars worth of camera equipment here, and we don't want them getting wet, because otherwise, all of them are gonna get completely destroyed. Uh, let's put this under there. Bro, the rain is so hard over here! Jake, that's you! Jake, I see your fingers over here. The raindrops are really heavy. Do you feel that? No, that's you! Wait, Jelly! Jelly's getting wet! You gotta protect Jelly. I just spent like hours moving them out and I'm like right Oh my goodness! David, you have so much texture on yours now. Little baby. What are you guys doing in the water? As a few of the artists sat in the water, others actually continued to work through the storm. Mackenzie. I will not stop working under any Mackenzie, it's literally pouring. I know, but, but I still need to go. I still need to win. Mackenzie, just settle for the 500. No! 500 is a lot of money. No, I will be happy with 500, but I would be even more happy with more money. Would you be happy with 10,000? Yes. I would scream and cry and cry in the ocean. Michelle, your piece is getting ruined. I know, but I have to keep working. Mine is so bad. <laughs> Michael, keep going, keep going. David, look. <laughs> Your thing has so many little holes in it. No, he's not supposed to look like that. Sorry. All right, guys, we're going to go in the ocean. Yeah. Wait for me. <laughs> well, wait, it's actually raining really hard. <laughs> the riptide's crazy. Wait, we're going to be away. Are you worried about your moon? No, because I basically just don't have a trench over there right now. All right, so it's raining really hard right now. Everyone's piece is getting ruined over there. I don't know how they're gonna recover. Also, I don't know how long it's gonna be raining for. It might be raining for the rest of the day. If it rains for the rest of the day, we play rock, paper, scissors, best of three. 
What? No, I'm gonna judge them as is. Oh my god. And honestly, Ben's probably gonna win from that. No, no, Ben's just gonna lose because his piece is gonna be ruined and my koi shape is there. Despite there being a storm outside, I was super caught off guard to see some of the artists continue to work. Okay, I can't believe it's pouring right now and those four are still working somehow. Wait, how are you guys still working? I wanna win. It's literally exactly what I need. But it turns out, the rain may have been a good thing. The wet sand made it easier to sculpt. Wait, I guess the, the rain does pack in the sand a little bit better. And since the contestants were clearly still able to work, there was no time for a break from the mini challenges. All right, guys, there's no time to relax. We have another mini challenge. David McKenzie, come over here. Faith, come over here. Oh, we have a challenge. McKenzie, what are you doing? Holy crap, she's peeing. she's peeing on camera. All right, it's raining really, really hard right now, but we gotta keep on going with the challenge because we don't have much time here. We gotta leave in a couple hours. Everyone, put your finger up. Touch the line. You guys will have one minute to draw the longest line. Three, two, one, go! Whoa, Michelle and Faith are pulling ahead. Ben, you're going so slow. Go, 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 go! Keep going, Michelle, you're falling behind. Go, 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 go! 30 seconds left! Go, go, go! Three, two, one! Oh. They drew that line so far out. I can't see. Jake, Mackenzie, come over here. You guys got two really big advantages. All right. Jake, you get first pick. Mackenzie, you get second pick. Okay. The moment the rain stops, you can choose one person and start a one hour countdown. And the other person can choose someone to help them for 30 minutes. Jake, you have first pick. Which one do you want? Which one do you want? Uh, I'm good with either. I'll start a countdown. All right, Mackenzie, you get someone's help for 30 minutes. As Jake and Mackenzie started to discuss their advantages, they seemed to have one target in mind. Are you going to do it to me? I don't think so, unless I want to keep the curse. Who did you bet on? David. David. You should start on being better. That's what I'm thinking. And I'll, I can uh, take 30 minutes from him. You can double whammy. Do I do that? You down for that? Okay, got it. Okay, we'll do that. All right, wait, did the rain just stop? Uh-oh. That's crazy. Oh All right, are you guys ready to drop the hammer on Ben? Yeah. I made bet on Ben, but his piece looks so good still anyways. What are you whispering? Well, I know something. I'm going to tell you this, but you can't go in and make a big deal about it or do anything, okay? What does it have to do with? I know what David's advantage that he won in the last challenge. What did you win? Water buckets. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And I think he's going to use it on Ben. So if we all triple whammy Ben, it could like really hurt me. Oh, so David gets to destroy something. Yeah. So, well, I think we okay. go stick with the plan. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are so <laughs> mean. Hi, yeah. hey, Bane. Bane, a travesty has happened. Oh, but then you're going to give someone else a better chance to win. And then no, your piece still looks good, so you're going to be able to win. Like, you're going you're gonna to help me for 30 minutes. Me? You want me to help you? Yeah. Wait, okay, what? you tell him now. Okay, Ben. You have one hour left. <laughs> Wait, so I only have 30 minutes left? Basically. Yeah. How did that happen? They decided to team up on you. It was a travesty. But you know, David's piece is going to look really good, and you bet on it. I yeah, bet on I David. I know, but I made a thingy with David. And I also made a thingy with David. Wait, Wait so we have an alliance? Okay, okay, we can be an alliance. Wait, you guys were plotting at sea? Yeah. We were plotting at we sea. We were playing mermaids. Hey, queen. Want to play mermaid? <laughs> You need to use it right now, though. I said within oh, an hour. Oh, pain! <laughs> Ow, heads! Now I'm pissed. Wait, why? Because now I wish I got the 30 minutes. Well, what do you want me to do about that now? Do you I want me want to give... 30 minutes. Do you want being help for 30 minutes? Do you want to negotiate something with me? Yeah. Okay, well then stop whining about it. And just when Ben thought things couldn't get any worse, David also used his punishment on him at the same time. It's okay, there's three targets Bean. in the span of five Bean. minutes. Uh, actually, David has two, so it could be four targets. I have two God. water buckets. You know what, it's okay because everyone's gonna riot. Okay, so let me explain my reasoning. Bean stepped on my house last video, so now he's getting water buckets on his dragon. Yeah, but you had a mound. But it was a cute mound and a cute chimney. Yeah, but you recovered so well. No, I, I got fifth. I got fifth. Show six. me the face. Show me the head. I got six. Show me the head. I got six. Show me the head. Zach did the head. I want to All right, the head. David. I'm not a deceiver. You're not. Hard. You're just a bad person. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, hey, hey wait, one. they held up better than Hold I thought. On. I'm getting another one. I'm putting them <laughs> harder. Okay, okay. <laughs> Okay. Oh! That was better. Oh, Ben! 
That was really uh, <laughs> David, why were you so brutal to Ben today? Cause he stopped at my house. After getting punished, Ben seemed to have lost all confidence. It's okay. I'm gonna spend the last 30 minutes not working on my piece and in the water because I give up. No. Look at me, look me in the eyes. <laughs> okay, actually look away. <laughs> okay, Ben. Still have 30 minutes. Anything can happen during judging. You might be able to knock a couple places off. But I you went could get your iPad. If you get third place, you can get your iPad mini. If you get second place, you can get the iPad you want. Uh, all right, Ken, what do you want me to do? Now, with 30 minutes of Ben's help, Mackenzie put him straight to work. Just like scrap them and do them however you think they should look, okay? Wait, Ben, are you excited to help Mackenzie? Yeah, I'm excited to help Mackenzie. That's his sarcasm voice. Mackenzie, I'm gonna be honest. I think you should twist the tentacles somewhat close to the body because if it's too spread out, I think you're going to have trouble keeping that like really clean look. Yeah, I think so too. And then if, if you can have them overlap, that'll be really cool. Bing, can you help me do that? No. The rain didn't do as much damage to the pieces as I thought. There's like some weird textures on it now, but overall, I don't think the rain destroyed everything as much as I thought it would. Hey Jake, actually if you think about it, we wanted to put water on our pieces anyway and the rain just dispersed it evenly. Yeah, this is perfect. That's what I was saying. The water's gonna make the sand perfect for sculpting. The rain was a blessing in disguise. As my friends continue to work on their pieces, I checked in with them once again. There's a huge prize on the line and they can literally win tens of thousands of dollars. And I wanted to make sure everyone was on track to finish their sand art pieces. Jake, that looks good. Honestly, if you're able to detail a lot and make it as clean as Mackenzie's, I really do think you could win. Me too. Oh wait, Michelle, it's actually looking a lot, lot better. Wait, I actually think the rain okay, helps uh, solidify your piece. Well, okay, the rain didn't do this. I did this. <laughs> wait, the rain made this. No, I did this. I'm just kidding. It looks good, Michelle. It looks Thank good. You. Wait, hey, this is actually looking really good too. Does the middle look gross? Or does it I. Look good? It looks cool, but I, I think you need to detail the middle a little bit more. Like, you should have like yeah. one really nice like circle in the middle or something. Okay. David, how did your piece hold up in the rain? Honestly, he held up really good. He got some more texture, but it doesn't take long to smooth out. And the rain kind of helped the sand become more compact. Are you going to turn it into a unicorn? Because I, I think that could be really cool. Yes, I'm going to turn it into a unicorn. And like I said, even though I can't win, I've been making an art piece, so I wanted to show you guys real quick. My dragon's not too bad, but I've been getting a little distracted. Uh, there's been some crazy things going on and I didn't want to miss any of the action. So ever since I helped Ben, I kind of abandoned my piece, but I'm gonna go back to working on it a bit. Before I introduce our new plushie, one of my videographers started to comment on the artist's looks. Michelle is giving Beverly Hills mom. Yay! Jake is giving European supermodel. Like, do I look like a Beverly Hills dad? No, you look like rich crypto guy. Now time for the big reveal. All right, so I have something to show my friend. This is our new plushie, Jelly, from zhcstore.com that just dropped. He is a cute purple octopus, and I'm gonna introduce Jelly to my friends to see what they think. Oh my god! <laughs> what do you think? Look at his little head! I love him! Oh my god, I love these little things. What are these? That's his little ears. His little ears? <laughs> Jelly. You like jelly? Well, one of you guys might be able to win 10 jellies for your friends and family. I need 10 jellies. Mackenzie, you know how you're making an octopus? Yeah. Say hello to jelly. <laughs> Jelly's our new plushie. This looks like mama jelly, this is like baby jelly. And for the next challenge, one of you guys has a chance to win 10 of these for friends and family. Oh my gosh, I want to win. That's so cute, I'm gonna get you sandy jelly. And we're matching! Faith, if you win the challenge, I'm family. Yeah! Michelle, not yet! You're not family yet! I'm trying, Zach! What was that? Jake, oh. it's jelly! Hi, jelly! Me, jelly! My hands are a little sandy, bud! So squishy! And kind of sandy right now. Very sandy. Don't worry, if you order from ZHCstore.com when jelly drops, they won't be sandy. Jelly shot, hot link. Alright, Jake, give me jelly. Alright. Jelly, meet my future wife, Michelle. Say hi to jelly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jelly is happy. Little do my friends know, Jelly was going to be a part of the next mini challenge as well. For this challenge, I'm gonna bring out Jelly out there, and we're gonna see who touches Jelly first and who touches Jelly last. Once they touch him, they're gonna hang on to him, and we're gonna see who touches him next, and after that, and after that, and after that. Hey guys, first person to touch Jelly wins! Another jet ski? You're gonna throw it somewhere. Oh, got it. Oh my god! Oh my god! Ah! Ah! I gotta abandon that. Ah! Oh, 
It was Ken. Ken. Unfortunately for Michelle, she was the last person to touch jelly, which means, yeah, she's getting punished. Michelle, you still gotta touch jelly. <laughs> this is the lock of shame. Oh, we're so slow. My pants are so long. <laughs> All right, everyone, return to shore. My pants are so long; it's slowing me down. Hey, do you want to toss me jelly? And then on the walk back, Michelle wasn't so lucky. You okay? Oh, that hurt. Oh, you stepped on a rock or something? No, I took off my pants and then stepped on a rock. Oh, no. oh, is it cut? I'm trying to see. Oh, that looks cut. I see. I see. Ooh. Yeah. Michelle, you're okay. Did I get a fancy? At least I'm on the boat probably, I feel like. Let's, let's get you back to under the tent, okay? Sorry. Yeah, after you guys get to the Yay! <laughs> oh, my oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wait, put me down, put me down, I can crawl. What? I can crawl the rest. I just need to be off the water. No, Wait, oh. just, oh. we just... Oh. 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 No, Michelle! I hate the water! Michelle, it's a long way to go. Are you sure? I feel like I'm allowed to do this. Yeah, that's so much fun. How did you think you were going to make it out of this? That was the most shocking thing I've ever seen. Don't carry me out of the What happened? I tripped away my long hands and then I stepped on the rock really hard and I cut my foot. Are you okay? Well, it doesn't hurt anymore, but. It was hurting. Oh, they sand all over it. I can't see it anymore. Are you okay? Does it hurt? Well, it did. I need to put it in water again. Okay, yeah. yeah. Okay, don't fall. Careful. Uh, okay. Oh, no. It's careful. not bleeding right now, but I feel like it will. Okay, careful, Michelle. How did that even happen? I'm clumsy. I tell you that. Oh. All right, come on, come on, let's get you to land. I got injured, but the sad part is I didn't get injured during the challenge. I got injured after coming back from the challenge. So I tripped over my long pants and I stepped on a rock really hard. And now the bottom of my foot is a little bit cut up and I don't think the beach is for me. Since Faith was the first person to touch jelly, she'll now receive an advantage. All right, Faith, for winning, you're gonna win two things. <gasps> so first thing you're gonna win is jelly. Yeah. And you get to give 10 jellies from ZHCstore.com to friends and family. Yay! You could also ask around if they want jelly because they're technically your friends. Mm -hmm. If you consider them your friends. Wait, raise your hand if you're friends with my sister. <laughs> Aww, I feel so loved. Well, so you got to choose 10 people. Do you, do you want to choose them? Okay, these five and then okay. our family has five people. Oh, so we have 10. Five and five. So all of them get one. You get one. I get one. Joy gets one. Mom and dad get one. Okay. Perfect! And you can get jelly right now at chcstore.com. The next advantage for my sister is absolutely huge. For your second advantage, during judging, we play rounds of sudden death until we get to the finals. We usually pair two people up at a time. Usually it's random, but this time you get to choose. Oh, I Does see. Does that make sense? But do I have to be a part of that or not? You need to compete at least once against oh, anyone you want. Okay. All right? Mm -hmm. You can get back to work. You guys might want to be extra nice to my sister because she's going to be the one deciding sudden death today. Do you want to go to Hawaii with me? And guys, third place, second place, first place all win something, so this is really important. You guys might want to spend some time talking to my sister. For the remaining contestants, I'm going to hand out punishments that get increasingly worse. Ben, for coming in second, you have one lap around all the boats on the jet ski. What? For getting third, you have two laps around the boats on the jet ski. Yeah. Mackenzie, you have three laps. Okay. David, you're gonna have four laps. I'm gonna launch myself. And Michelle, you have five laps on the jet ski. All right, Ben, you're up first. So, I won the last challenge, and now I have some company. You didn't drive it. So cute. I'm starting to think that the shells and stuff that I was going to include around the starfish are a little ambitious now so I might just kind of do a fun little border around it. Everyone else is really big but I am trying my best and I think it looks quite nice. 
While Ben hopped onto the jet ski to do his punishment, the remaining contestants attempted to sweet talk Faith since she now chooses the sudden death matchups. <laughs> Girly pop! If you spare me for a few rounds so I can at least win a little bit of money, I'll buy you a bevy later! Will you? Yeah. Oh, we can oh, get bevies. But also, if you don't, I forgive you because you're a goddess. <laughs> All right, now it's my turn to bribe Faith. So, yes. <laughs> I would love to be picked one of the last ones for sudden death. What would it take to get that? I don't know, Michelle. I'm hard to please. <laughs> Oh, you know what? I voted for David. Oh my God, so, I did! Or I bet it on David. Well, if you're not gonna help me, at least help Mackenzie so I can win some money. <laughs> yeah, I do think Mackenzie deserves it. No, 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 usually the ones that deserve it yeah, <laughs> shouldn't be in this hall. She the has finals. that smile! I see her smile! She's trying to deceive you! No, I'm not trying to deceive you. I just want to win money. Right, and I want that for you. So, and I will also buy you a bevy if I win. <laughs> and we're both Aries, so. We are both Aries. Exactly. Fire and fire. Exactly. Okay. Hey. Don't pretend like you don't want anything from me right now. I'm not here to deceive you, and I'm not here to offer you a bevy or okay. anything like that. <laughs> My heart. What I'm basically- Change your case, quickly. What I'm trying to say is, please don't make me go up against everybody in the sudden death. I will consider it, Jake. Thank you. Hey, Faith. Hi. I've gotten so many punishments this video. Can you please be nice to me in the finals? You know what? I think that's valid, honestly. Also, I try to help you in the begin in the first challenge with the metal detector. I don't even though you didn't win, I'm sorry, but I it was a thought that counts. I only have 30 minutes left. Do you? Yeah, I got targeted five times. In a row. In a row. Hey, just remember, be nice. <laughs> Thank you. Lastly, it was Michelle's turn to do her punishment laps on the jet ski. And, well, let's just say she was being extremely careful. And I mean, extremely careful. Guys, look at Michelle. It's so funny. <laughs> I don't think she wants to get close to the boat. Or maybe her thing's malfunctioning, do you think? She's scared to go any faster. But that's slow. Yeah, I think she's scared. Now that the contestants have finished their punishments, I once again walked around to take a look at their progress. All right, I'm gonna go take a look at everyone's pieces so far. Whoa! <laughs> Dave, really David, I actually think you have a really good chance of winning. Yeah, I think you, you need to dig out the back a little bit more for okay. some more depth. Okay, Mackenzie, very impressive. Thank you. I'm not gonna lie, the head looks pretty crazy. Thanks. Oh, wait, wait, that's actually a really good idea, making it come out of the sand. Mm -hmm. Mackenzie, this yeah. is one of my favorite pieces from you, but at the really? same time, you do have some insane competition. I know. I, I'm like taking a look at around, and I see a couple really insane pieces, I so know. you gotta make sure you really blow everyone out of the park. I know. Wait, Michelle, this is really coming along now. I know. Very impressive. Oh, wait, Ben, you're recovering. Barely. You have around 25 minutes left. Get as much detail in if you need to add a couple eggs or something. It still looks really impressive. Thank you. I still think you have a chance, Ben. All right, Faith, this actually looks quite impressive. Does it? Wait, I, I just realized you found a hack. Faith <sighs> realized that the bottom of the water bottle looks kind of like a scallop or whatever. Yeah. And she's using it to, to indent patterns. That's actually really cool, Faith. Thank you. And it seems like you have a lot of power today, especially <laughs> in judging. A lot of people seem to be sucking up to you. <laughs> I'm trying to do what you're doing. That's such a good idea. Oh, now Mackenzie's copying you. Good. At this point, I'm kind of just working on the body up here. I kind of like the skull. It's pretty cool, but I definitely need to add some more details right now. I'm going to go do that right now. We have like an hour and 15 minutes left of the challenge, and so far I'm really happy with my unicorn. I've sculpted the body, the legs, and the head. Now I'm working on the horn, and I'm gonna go ahead and work on the mane and the tail. While I let the contestants cook, I decided to take a dip in the ocean. We're gonna go swimming. And there were tons of super cool white fish. And just take a look at how clear and cool this water looks. There's so many fish here. I saw Jake walking over, I had to let him use the goggles. Wait, check it out, there's so many cool white fish. It 
safe to say, he thought it was pretty cool too. Since David 2, my videographer bet on Mackenzie, he decided to walk around and scope out the competition. It's going through your head, Faith. My skin burns. And I don't know if it's from getting sunburned or if it's the sand. I think I'm done with the sand. I just want this challenge to be over. And my seashells didn't work out, so now I'm gonna make something else, but I don't know what it's gonna be. It's looking pretty good. You like it? Yeah, but just feel like it needs more detail. I know, I'm gonna go through and try to put some tentacles on some of these. Yeah, I think you should just do better. Oh, okay. That's and, great uh, advice. You know, try harder. Thanks. I just feel like, you know, this right here, uh -huh. I don't think that's gonna cut it. You know, everyone says I'm cursed, but it kind of seems like it'd be all your fault if I lost, so. Oh, would it? Because that's not the way that anyone else is treating it. I mean, if I lose, it's just not my fault. Seems that I picked the artists who just don't want to try that hard, so I'm I... literally trying so hard. What well, are you talking about? I mean, you need to do better, so. Okay. As Jake continued to work, he started to get a bit frustrated. God damn it, I don't want to dig anymore. Because he's been digging around the piece for hours uh. at this point. So much digging! But at least the parts he was carving looked really smooth. Whoa, Jake, yours is so smooth. Thank you. Wait, Jake, what did you use to smooth it out? Uh, I just carved from it and then used the, I just used these tools and then patted it with my hand. Since Michelle was making excellent progress on her piece, she took her time walking around to check out the other contestants' art. That's so cute, Zachary. Oh, thanks. Wow! But that's a really good it's so hard. Oh my god, it's so precious! Yes. I love it! I know, I love her. Little, little guy. It's so precious! The head looks amazing. Thank you. And as Ben's time was about to end, disaster struck with Jake's piece. Alright Ben, I'm gonna give you another minute and I'm gonna count you down. Unfortunately, as he was constructing the fin, it completely broke. Oh my god, the whole fin just fell off. Ah! Oh. I'm not gonna lie. He looks pretty devastated. The whole thing just fell off. How are you feeling? I'm sweating so much because I've been digging for so long. And after his piece broke, I think his mind broke too. I'm feeling crazy. I'm getting the zoomies. I'm getting kind of psycho. Sometimes I feel like you just chew. You ever just chew water? I just really don't think that my piece can compete at this point. There's not enough time. I'll just go work on Zach's, why not? I feel like the first thing that I would need is water for wet sand. That should be enough. To work on Zach's sand art piece, all that I need is some wet sand. Oh, I dropped the bucket. All right, I just need some wet sand. Oh, I dropped the bucket. I feel like all I need is some wet sand. Oh. I dropped the bucket. I just need some wet sand. Shoot, I keep dropping it. Bucket. More wet sand for the piece. Get the sand. I almost am done. What are you doing? We just need wet sand. <laughs> it's easier to sculpt. I feel like you're destroying it. Where's the sand? All right, perfect. Before we continue with the challenge, I pull Ben aside because we have something kind of sad to tell you guys. All right, guys, so I'm gonna pull Ben aside for a sec because I have a big but kind of sad announcement to make. Ben, can I talk to you for one second? Yeah, sure. You're in a lot of trouble. Oh, no. Is anyone there? No. All right, let's go over there. Okay, I'm scared. You should be. You know it's not a good sign when someone says, we need to talk. Oh God. We need to talk, Ben. Oh no. Have a seat, Ben. Have a oh, seat. Oh God. Okay. Have a seat. Ah. Wait, let me see. Damn, this is actually nice. Damn. Would you like the Bahamas so far? I love the Bahamas. Thank you for taking me. Yeah, no problem. We already talked about it before. Yeah. But I do have a bit of a sad announcement to make. I met you how many years ago? It's almost going to be four years. I think I've known you for four years, yeah. and you've officially worked with us for three years. Dude, you've had me for all my adult years. <laughs> Wait, do you remember the first video you were in? I do. The first time I met Ben was when he participated as a subscriber. Yeah. So we used to live in LA and that's where I met Ben and that's also around where you grew up. And we moved to Texas three years ago. I moved a lot of our team with us and Ben came along. Ben gave me some very, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's some sad news, but Ben is moving back to California. Yeah. Um, you, 
Yeah, you told me you got your friends there, you got your family there, so I'm not gonna lie, I'm genuinely sad, Ben. It was a tough decision because I love working here so much and genuinely working for Zach and everyone else has been the best three years of my life. I couldn't ask for a better job, better boss. No, Ben, you're friend. supposed to say you hate us and leave. <laughs> no, how could I say that? That's why it was a no, tough no, decision. But, yeah, Ben is officially moving back to California. Uh, yeah, dude, that's crazy to think about. You've been with us for so long. Dude, I feel like so much has happened. So many experiences, so many memories, so many punishments too. I know. <laughs> but I, I wouldn't ask for anything else. Like, I think it was genuinely the best three years of my life. And, you know, you guys are the best. You guys literally saw me grow from being a subscriber to an artist. Dude, they really did. When, yeah. when you first came on, you were so shy and quiet. I was. Bro. Ben literally walked in the very first day because okay. he was such a Are big really fan. Are you really saying this right now? And he was like, hi, my name is Ben. And I was like, hi, I'm Zach. And he's like, I know. Yes, I was such a big fan of Zach. <laughs> and yes, I was starstruck, which is why like, I was super nervous in the beginning. But you know, over time, me and Zach became really yeah. good friends. And it's been a pleasure. Yeah, I mean, uh, uh, yeah, I'll be honest. It, I, I'm pretty sad that you're going. dude. Dude, I, I honestly love working with you, and and Ben is one of my best friends. I'm gonna miss playing basketball with Zach. I know. <laughs> that was so Dude. much fun. We played so much basketball. Yeah, now we're gonna be missing our point guard. Uh, it's, but It's your time to be point guard. <laughs> I'm sad that you're leaving. Usually I don't show a lot of emotion, but Michelle was so sad that when, when she heard that Ben was leaving, and she just started sobbing, and she's like, who's oh. gonna help me in crafts videos now? I'm still always gonna help Michelle in crafts videos. She can always call me in, in the middle of the videos, and I will <laughs> give her some advice. And in front of you guys, just because just I want you guys to know, Ben, I want to wish you good luck in California. Thank you, Zach. This, Thank you for this, everything. This is Ben's last official full-time video with us. If he comes again, he's gonna come as a guest. I'm just gonna fly you out. I'm gonna bring you on sometimes. I think you're gonna do great things in California. Thank you. And you better still text me. I will. Dude, if this guy ghosts me, <laughs> I'm gonna expose him. Hey, if Ben blocks me, I'm gonna tell you guys to get him in the comments. No, 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 no. I'll never do that. I'm gonna text you guys so often. And I mean, we're still gonna be working with each other. Oh yeah, that's true. We're working on a fashion brand together. I mean, I still hit Ben up a lot of times just for like YouTube business stuff. So we'll still be working a lot. It's just that it's gonna be sad not having you right by us. Definitely. It was a tough I wish decision. you could teleport. <laughs> I wish teleportation was a thing. Maybe so you in could, 10 years. So you could live in California, you can be with your family and friends, uh -huh. and in one snap, you can be with us too. The ZHC family will always be a part of me. All of this, employees, coworkers, it all goes beyond that. It's all like a, one big family and like, you know, I couldn't be more appreciative of everything there. I also hope you guys are nice to Ben and wish wish Ben good luck on his move. Ben, we, we all love you, I love you. They're all gonna say, why did why Ben do another, another dragon, dragon in this video? video? Ben does so many Yeah, dragons. you know what? <laughs> Roast Ben for doing a dragon. Guys, this is gonna be the last dragon. He's probably dragon. gonna be doing dragons in California. No, this is gonna be the last dragon you guys see for a while. So I had to, I had to end with a bang. Well, you guys will see Ben once in a while. Uh, I'll, I'll definitely let you guys know when he's here. Thank you, Zach. And one more handshake. I, ben, I'll never forget you. And of course, I have to say thank you to the ZHC Crafts fandom. I mean, they are the best fans in the whole world, especially the Ben fans. I love you guys. And Dude, the Ben fans are probably punching the air right no, now. No, Ben fans, remember, you guys are the goats. You guys will always be the king of Crafts videos. You just stay there. Be with Michelle in spirit. Michelle needs it. Wait, what's the saying? Ben fans, don't be sad that it's over. Be happy that it happened. Yeah, what he said. Is it kind of like that? Yeah, no, that's exactly what it is. Ben fans, wish Ben good luck. Love Even if you're not a Ben fan, wish him good luck. Thank you. I love right, you guys. Ben, ben, I'm gonna miss you, man. All right, go hug. I love you, Ben. Dude, you gotta go say goodbye to everyone. Who do you want to start with? I don't know. I'm just gonna go to Faith and just be like, goodbye. I'm gonna miss you. Okay, sure. Faith, goodbye. I'm gonna miss what? you. Thank you for everything. Oh, wait. What? <laughs> wait, this is so sudden. What? That's it? Yeah, goodbye, Faith. What? Thank you for everything. The last three years have been amazing. Have I known you for three years? No, you haven't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's why you're the first person I chose okay. to say goodbye to, but no, seriously. Have a great time, Ben. Yeah, but seriously, you barely know her, Ben. David. Babe. My last official video, so I gotta give you a hug. Babe. Uh, Wait, David, do you have anything you want to say to Ben in California? Bean, I'm gonna come visit. And we're gonna go to Disney and slay. Oh my god, look at David's face. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have anything else you want to say to Ben? Bean, you're the true crafts king. 
And you're the best. Thanks, David. And again, I told Bean this earlier, but whenever Bean's around, I feel really safe. Because <laughs> Bean always makes sure things get done. <laughs> I appreciate it. As much as I target him and, in videos, you know, it's all. And it's I all and I talk a lot of crap about cancers, but he's actually a really good cancer and really great. Love you, Bean. You know, Ken's came in at the same time as me. We were both like 18, and he just took us for our last three years. Yeah. <laughs> you still are you. Last three years have been fun. You. Good luck in all your endeavors in California, and I'll come visit you, and you can come visit me. All right, sounds good. Guys, I'm really hurting. Are you sure I should do this to Jake right now? He might not finish. Just go for it. Okay. Hey, bye. I'm gonna give you a hug, buddy. All right. It's been a fun three years. This was Team Carrot right here. Ben, you know how I feel. I do. I ben fans, get him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I know how Jake feels. We already talked about this. He's like a brother from a really different mother. And as Ben got to Michelle, she already seemed very overwhelmed. No! No, Michelle! No! Don't say goodbye. No, she didn't cry when I was sleeping. <laughs> I'm still gonna come back. You can still call me during. No, why did you say it was your last video? No, last official video. But I'll still be back. You'll come back. And then you can call me in any video if you need help. Okay. Guys, Mich I wasn't ready for this. Michelle, do you have anything you want to say to Ben? No. Michelle, <laughs> come on. You've known Ben for so long. I know. It's okay, Michelle. Do you need help for the last hour? I'll help you. Sure. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I want to be gone. I'll miss you all. I'll miss you, Marcy. I don't want to say anymore. I'm okay. I'm just fine because I didn't get that. Yep. Okay, give Ben a hug. Give Ben a hug. Guys, Munchie's the best. Ben fans support Munchie endlessly in every video after this. <laughs> oh, Michelle! Zach, Zach, I didn't mean to make your wife cry. <laughs> yeah, Ben, what the heck? I'm sorry. Are you okay, Michelle? Yeah, I'll just miss you too. Every time you come to California, let me know and then we'll get okay. Korean barbecue. Okay. I'll help you for the rest of the challenge. Right. What do you need me to do? I need a tissue. <laughs> okay, I'll get Michelle a tissue first. <laughs> First time I met Ben, I just thought you were so so innocent. I was, and then but you, guys... you were you were so young. I was. <laughs> I literally just got out of high school. I was 18, <laughs> and you guys have like taken me for the last three years, and now I'm 22. He's still very sweet, and I'm gonna miss you a lot. I'm gonna miss you, Munchie. You I better come back. I will. I'll come visit. Okay. I'll come visit on vacation now. Okay. I can come visit anytime. We'll visit too. Okay. All right. Team Munch. Oh, sorry. <laughs> David. I gotta say bye to David. You know, when I first moved to Austin, we all moved at the same time, and uh, Ben was the first one to come up to me and be like, everyone likes you, man. Like, you should work here full time. I did actually do that, and then I invited him to play basketball. Yep, and I went and played basketball. And, and I, I never friendly. thought I would see him ever again. <laughs> not true, not true. He knew. I knew David was the one right when he got here. And look where he is now. He's 0 for 13. <laughs> As time started to wind down, I gave the artist a 10 minute warning and suggested Jake continue working on his piece. Hey guys, 10 minute warning! Jake, are you gonna keep working on your piece? I totally messed up. I did the scales wrong. Oh, we should still try to... And I also had no idea what he did to mine during this time. Not bad, David. Wait, this, this looks so cool. Isn't it cool? It looks like a real freaking horse. Maybe you can get a little bit more definition of the hooves. Hey guys, six minutes! Not bad, Mackenzie, not bad. For the last 10 minutes, I think I'm just gonna try to like clean up the tail a little bit, or at least what is showing of it. I think I bit off more than I could chew. I spent most of the competition digging because I wanted to get a lot of depth, and it did allow me to create some really smooth, cool carvings, but at the end of the day, it also made me not finish my piece. And then I finally saw the catastrophe that was now my art piece. If you can even call it that at this point. Step in it! No, I didn't! You stepped in it! That was like Oh my god, what's that? Someone stepped in it! You're using that bucket, right? Can you step in it? Oh, no, that's Jake! Jake! Move aside, Ben. No! Oh my god, Jake. Um, yeah. Would you care to explain yourself? I heard there was leftover chicken strips. About yeah. my sand art, Jake. Oh. 
What about it? Somebody said you did it. Michelle! No, 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 Jacob! <laughs> what the heck happened? My piece was not looking so good. I was a little frustrated, so I decided that I would work yeah. on yours. Did you step in it? No, I just created wet sand. All right, you may need to put down the camera for this part. Wait! And now, with just a few minutes left, my friends worked tirelessly to add their final details. Everyone, five, ah! four, five. three, two, one! Time's up! No! You're working on your piece. You were just destroying mine. Hey, everyone! Great job this video! Woo! Also, don't forget, first place will get $1,000 for every million views on this video. Woo! So, make sure you watch this, share this with your family, share this with your siblings, share it with your grandma. Get a lot of people to watch it so they can win some money. Also, if this video does really well, I'll bring you to the Bahamas more. Woo! Yeah! All right, Jake, let's start with you. Jake, tell me about this piece. Well, this was gonna be a koi fish, and then everything started to go downhill once I was sculpting the fin over here, and then it just cracked for no reason. And then it really went downhill again when I did the scales, and originally I was gonna use sand and pack it on top and make them, but then for some reason I started carving, and then I realized that was not the move to go. Jake, it still looks really cool. It's so clean, you got a lot of structure. Like, I don't even know how you got that entire, like, ridge in. I feel like I have the strategy down, but I just didn't execute. Mm -hmm. Typical Jake. Yeah. But it still looks good, Jake. Yeah. I don't think people are gonna be able to tell it's a koi fish. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie, but it, it looks cool. All right, very nice, Jake. Very nice. All right, Michelle. What are we looking at here? Okay, so I did a snail oh, and geez. I carved out the shell, put sticks as antennas. Michelle, it looks really cute, and, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm not sure. Well, Actually, all of you guys know, Michelle started out this year like O of 20 or O of 21 or something. In the last 10 videos, she's already gotten like four wins. Woo! Yeah. yeah. Which is insane, Michelle. Three. It's it's not as large as some of the others, but yeah. still a lot of detail. Very impressive. Thank you. Good job, Michelle. Thank you. Oh, you're sticky. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. All right. Go. Oh my goodness, David. <laughs> what the heck? David, David, this is insane. Yeah, that's Oh, it's yeah. my little unicorn wow. buddy. David, this might be one of your better pieces, I'm not gonna lie. I'm obsessed Wait, with Wait, David, and it's so big. It's massive, you could literally ride it if it was real. The da horn looks so amazing. David, this is like so wow. good. David, how did you do this? Last time we did sand art, I built up and it was awful. And this time I dug down and I found that carving into the ground instead of building up was a lot easier. And then the rain helped stick everything together. And it kind of gave him like fur texture. Yeah, surprisingly, so. the rain actually helped us. I thought it was gonna destroy everyone's pieces, but I guess it, it it kind of packed in the sand. And his name is Charlie and he's a cancer in honor of Bane. Aww. Bane! Bane. Aww. That's Bane. I don't think I've ever had a cancer piece, so. Yeah, yeah. Wait, also, Jake, David, Faith, you guys didn't use your immunity cards for Yeah, anything. what the hell? I knew that oh. was gonna happen. What you guys yeah. done? You guys just kept you getting punished Wait, over and over again. Wait, can I say again. something? Whatever, what? if there's a punishment for this video, I use my immunity. Me too. Well, David, very nice job. Thank it you. It was amazing. <laughs> All right, Ben, tell me about your piece. Okay, well, I've done that a thousand times, so I don't really need to explain it. It's a dragon. Nice. I mean, Ben, considering you got targeted so much, you got your piece destroyed, you lost a lot of time, and it's your last full video. <laughs> you did pretty well. You did pretty well. Thank you. Well, I actually thought people would take it easy on you because it's your last full video, but I, I guess they wanted to send you off with yeah. a bang. Oh, they definitely did. All right, well, you still have a very good structure. I like the detail. The skull's especially nice. You did do it originally until David destroyed it, so technically I rebuilt it. I had to. I was not being deceitful this video. All right, well, good job, Ben. Good job. All right, Mackenzie, tell so us about bad. your piece. This is my octopus. At some point, it accidentally had 10, ten, ten tentacles, but it is down to uh, the normal eight. And I added those little drippy droppings for texture. Mackenzie, uh, this is insanely impressive. I love the shape. I, I love how the tentacles like spiral in and out of each other. And David, you did bet on Mackenzie. And as you guys know, David's been cursed the last 13 times he's bet. He's 0 of 13. David, I'm not gonna lie though, this piece is pretty good and you might just get your first win or you might have cursed Mackenzie. Yeah, I really think the curse is gonna be put to the test today because this is looking really good. David, I don't think you made the wrong choice, but there are a lot of other very, very yeah. good pieces that she has to go up against. Yeah, I know, that's a big dilemma here. All right, well, Mackenzie, I'm super, super impressed. Thank you. Nice job, I, I, I think this is genuinely one of your best pieces. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right, Faith, how did you enjoy this trip? It was so fun. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not prepared to win because I'm looking around and you guys are so cool. 
Oh, like, you guys are all so talented and like pro sculptors. It's crazy. Wait, 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 wait. Talk about your piece. Talk about your piece. Okay, okay. What do we have here? I made a starfish and I decided to incorporate some different textures and I used a water bottle to stamp a little design around the starfish. I love the detail. I love it, it looks too. really cool. Very nice. You did a great job. Very nice. Come on. And comment if you want to see my little sister again. Uh, if, Do it. If, if people end up liking you, I'll, I'll bring you out a little bit more, okay? What if they don't like you? I'll come visit at mom and dad's place you just where you're still living. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Great job, Faith. Great okay. job. <laughs> hey, be, be nice to my sister in the comments. Be nice to my sister. All right. Wait, do you want to show them your feet? Oh, yeah. Um, okay. Somebody crushed it and drew a wow. smiley face on it. Oh, <laughs> it looks like me, though. It was. Jake! <laughs> He's fleeing the scene. Jake! <laughs> Is he just chasing us? All right, everyone, get on the boat. All right, Faith, you get to decide who goes head to head in sudden death, so who's okay, going? First, Ben. What? And Mackenzie. All right. What? what? Right. Oh my god, the book cards! The book cards! Ah! <laughs> David is cursed! Dude. Dave! That's what you did on! Hey guys, I'm gonna send it to a few people. First person to respond what? wins. So, I'm literally oh, what? There's <laughs> okay, we got it. No way. Are you kidding me? All right, so if you lose, you jump in. The person moving on is. Bro, I swear. Mackenzie! Oh my gosh. Alrighty. 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 All right, get in, Ben. Bye. Bye, Ben. Bye, Bye, Wow, for my last crash video, I get last. <laughs> Who's next? Give me two more names. Don't put me again. Okay. Don't put me again. <laughs> Ah! Oh my God! All right. Why did you do this? Oh my God. Oh my God. No, but now you put it down. I know why, baby. It's because she bet on David. You told her to do this. They did it. Oh my God. This is so much fun. Oh no! Oh, we got a vote. We got a vote. Uh, the person that's moving on is. Bye, Jake! Bye, Bye Jake! Even though my time on Survivor has come to an end, I'll be back. All right, Faith. Okay, next, Michelle and Mackenzie. Oh, wait, oh, a lot of people do Faith like cute snails. Faith, you're a goddess. Mackenzie is fine, Faith, though. Faith, I'm not you money. Mackenzie, it shows how much faith I have in you. Oh my god, and your name's Faith. And my name's oh my god, Faith. the girl! You're so special. <laughs> you're a liar. I'm lying. Wait, guys, guys, they're typing, they're typing. Oh, okay. The person that's moving oh, on is. Please, please, please. Please. Mackenzie. Oh, thank goodness. Oh. Hi, Michelle. Oh. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I'm getting money! Oh, my oh, Hi, Michelle. Man, that was so fun. Oh, that was so much fun. Oh, that was so much fun. Oh, that was so much fun. Oh, that was so Oh, so you do want him to make it to the finals? Oh, yeah. yeah. I thought she was 500. So, are you going yeah. against Mackenzie now? It's me and Mackenzie. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. Oh, come on, give me second place so I can at least take a look. Either way, you're the top three. You guys are walking away with a minimum of 500. Yeah! All right. Oh, come on. The person that's moving on is. Faith! No joke. I'm not joking. Oh, a random yeah. subscriber picked you. I told you guys. I'm sorry, Wait, Mackenzie. No, the curse is that. real. Wait, no, I feel really bad now. I'm sorry, Mackenzie. Wait, no joke. No joke. David, look, I'm not lying. I'm oh literally God. not lying. David, say bye to Mackenzie. Bye, Mackenzie. Bye, bye Mackenzie. No. Bye. Join us. Join us. Wait, Mackenzie, you got 500. I hate these videos. I bet on David. Dude, it's a curse. <laughs> David, you are cursed! Wait, let me turn this around real quick. No, cursed. That's cursed. Cursed. That is a curse if I've ever seen one. Cursed. cursed. That is unreal. Cursed. Cursed. Unreal. cursed. So, for the finals, I'm gonna ask three subscribers which one their favorite piece is. May the best one win. Wait, can I show you guys real quick? I'm not gonna lie, the starfish looks really good on camera. Wait, Faith, you get at least a thousand. No, a thousand five hundred. If what? I win, you get a thousand five hundred. Because it's five hundred plus a thousand. For You're something. right! Yeah. Oh, I am so small. <laughs> I'm lucky. Thank you, David. <laughs> Both Davids.
first. Oh, okay, first vote's Penzo coming in. Back. The first vote goes to... David! Woo! You need three votes to win. What's up, Mackenzie? How do you feel? I'm pissed. And I'm sick and tired of not winning. Second vote! We should bring Faith on more. <laughs> Second <laughs> vote goes to... Faith! Let's go, Starfish! You need three votes to win! Go, Faith! Go, Faith! Go, Faith! So Faith, you might actually win! David, Faith, the least you can win is a thousand, so we're eating. That's, insane. That's pretty good. Second vote goes to. <laughs> Faith! <laughs> Wait, Faith, you might actually win! You need, you need one more vote votes. to win. You need one more vote to win! Starfish! 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 Star, but also 500 on David! <laughs> Next vote goes to oh. David. Woo! All right, so we're tired. Next, next vote decides it all. Final vote is in. Final vote. The winner of the Saint Nord video is. Faith. Oh That's a Give Faith a hug and go in the water. All right, go in the water, David. <laughs> oh my Wait, God. my sister won a video! I literally cannot believe that. That's insane. I got a thousand. That'll pay off a little bit of it. Yeah, that's so good. Well, what are you gonna do with the money? I have no oh. idea. Wait, you can move out of mom and dad's place and get a place and pay your own rent. Are you gonna invest it? Yeah. Well, guys, let me know if you want my sister again. I I, I still can't believe you won. I can't believe it either. Well, I don't feel very deserving. All right, goodbye. Wait, that's <laughs> Goodbye. No! Oh, All right. Wait, see you guys <laughs> later. Woo! <laughs> 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 <laughs>